So for this extrusion, we're going to have some, um, some things we're definitely going to want to check, some settings. And so first, we're going to extrude. We need to make sure it's add, not new. We need a depth of 0.75, and we need to make sure that the option symmetric is selected. So coming back here, we're still working with this sketch. We're going to extrude it. We want a depth of, what was it, 0.75? Yep. So 0.75. And then we want to make sure we click symmetric. And it's an add, not new. So I think I got the settings correct. Let's take a look at what we've created. So that extrusion just gave depth this way to these two rectangles and stuck them together. So now we have kind of a place on the truck now. This thing keeps giving me headaches about me zooming. We have a place on the truck now to be able to mount some other parts. And so we want to rename this piece the truck base plate. And so since that was a new extrusion, it created a new part. And so we can rename that the truck base plate. So again, we created a new extrusion with this plate here, which created a new part Then we added to it with this extrusion down here. And now this whole thing together is going to be considered the truck base plate. And I can turn the visibility for it off like that. It disappears. And I go, hey, where's my truck base plate? I go back over here. And I click the eye again. It reappears. We, bien.